Black holes are crazy for a number of reasons, but one of the biggest mysteries about them is what lies at the center? What is at the center of a black hole? General relativity predicts that there is a space-time singularity at the center of a black hole. The problem is, a space-time singularity typically occurs when mathematics breaks down. A space-time singularity, if we were to take it from the literal sense, is a zero-dimensional point, literally like the point on a graph, but it has infinite density. Technically speaking, there could be a physical singularity there. It's not technically impossible, mainly because we've never proven that singularities don't exist because it's very, very hard to prove that something that we've never seen, never detected, never even been able to imagine doesn't exist. It's very difficult. It's just really, really, really unlikely that it's actually a literal singularity. So as it currently stands, we don't know what is at the center of a black hole. But what's interesting is we can predict what will likely happen if you were to approach the center of a black hole, you know, aside from being torn apart through spaghettification. Gravitational time dilation is where, under the effects of gravity, an object will experience less time. So a long amount of time will pass outside the effects of this gravity, but a short amount of time will pass within the effect of this gravity. Therefore, we can conclude that as you get closer and closer to the center of a black hole, you experience more and more time dilation. So you're experiencing a lot more time passing than an outside observer would. We can conclude then that as you get closer and closer to the center of a black hole, which as we currently know, it's the strongest force of gravity in the universe. It's a force of gravity that not even light can escape. As you get closer and closer to the center of this, you experience less and less time passing. So technically speaking, the center of a black hole viewed as a moment of time rather than just as an object, in a way may lead to the end of the universe. If the universe really does have a quote unquote death date, then being exposed to that kind of time dilation, you will pass millions of years, billions of years. You may quite literally reach that death date in what to you feels like very, very little time at all. That's just theoretical though. There's no real way to test that since we don't have a black hole. And even if we did have a black hole, we still probably couldn't test it. <laughs> but either way, it's a cool thought experiment.